We're talking about rent, groceries, gas. Everything seems to be more expensive, and a new survey revealed Floridians are having a hard time keeping up. And half of Floridians said that they have a hard time paying bills to afford necessities due to inflation. For some families, that means cutting down on eating out and those date nights. Yeah, News for Jack's consumer investigator Lauren Verno joining us now. Lauren, I understand you found a, a one industry heavily affected by inflation here that uh, parents probably haven't noticed here. <laughs> yeah, so I will start with inflation has affected everything. You don't have to be a parent to notice right. that, but parents, you've probably noticed babysitting rates. Now, I remember making about 10 bucks an hour to babysit in high school. The new nation's average rate, get this, it is $20.57 an hour for one child and $23.25 an hour for two children, which has many families questioning whether a night out from the kids is even worth it. <laughs> Mom, Tina Peckham, never stops moving with her two boys. And one for Austin. Two-year-old Austin and five-year-old Archer. Can you give me those wooden spoons? So that downtime alone with her husband is cherished. We try to do date nights um, ideally once a month. That's the goal, but we don't have anything really scheduled. We don't have family here. So um, it's a matter of finding the time to get away and making sure it makes sense financially, obviously. And we all know things add up quickly. For you guys to have a date night, how much is it going to run you? Oh my gosh, for like dinner and a movie and not even like at a really nice restaurant, um, just basic, I would say about 150, maybe 200. And the babysitting cost is, is a good half of that. Advanced Home Care Placements owner Sharon Edmondson says that's a steal compared to what nanny rates are going for. Now they're going to be looking at $24 an hour probably at a minimum. And if we're bringing somebody in from somewhere else, it could be much higher than that. We're seeing rates, rates anywhere from 22 to as much as 35 an hour. And that's the rate for one or two children. When you start getting into three to four, um, we've done some placements recently that are up in the 80 to 110,000 a year. Edmondson says when COVID hit, many parents wanted to keep their children home, which drastically raised the demand for even part-time nannies. And it makes it difficult uh, from an agency perspective uh, in, in um, passing that along to the consumer and explaining that. Great. And what are you going to buy with your money? Hot Wheels? And while most parents like Edmondson only need a babysitter every once in a while. Are you okay? Yeah. Everyone is feeling the pinch. Yeah, that is for sure. And for those pet parents out there, yeah, cost of pet sitting also has gone up. The national average right now for just watching your pet is going to cost you $16. Cost per dog walk, $18. Mary, I don't mean to call you out, but you said you didn't make almost $2? There, oh, back when I was a babysitter, but I tell you about, there's a reason why I'm working here right now, because I got a lot of pets. Look at those char- I, No, Mary, <laughs> could you imagine if uh, you had to have all your dogs walked? It's no. not possible. Yeah, not for that. And, and John Gone also babysat is something else we learned during that story, so. I know. We're a lot older than you are, though, Lauren. There you go. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs>